A seamless high-speed rail system linking Las Vegas with downtown Los Angeles is the goal adopted today by representatives of Desert Express and the Los Angeles Metropolitan Transit Authority. Desert Express Enterprises already is trying to build a high-speed rail line between Las Vegas and Victorville, California. A new agreement signed today makes possible a second leg linking Victorville to Palmdale, California and eventually Los Angeles. Representatives of Desert Express Enterprises, developers of a high-speed speed rail line between Las Vegas and Victorville, California, signed a letter of intent with Los Angeles Metropolitan Transit Authority today that opens the door to the Las Vegas-Los Angeles route. Construction of the train line is expected to generate 80,000 primary and secondary jobs. Most of the jobs, however, would be in California because that's where most of the track would be located. The Bureau of Land Management Winnemucca District has issued a decision record for an environmental assessment for the Jackson Mountains Wild Horse Gather. The decision is issued in full force and effect to begin gathering 630 excess wild horses on June 8th because of drought conditions in the herd management area, which is about 60 miles northwest of Winnemucca, Nevada in Humboldt and Pershing counties. The BLM says it is necessary for the health of the horses to get the excess animals off the range now before their condition worsens. Nevada State Health Division has announced its participation in the 2012 Text for Baby State Enrollment Contest, a national competition to enroll pregnant women and new mothers in the Text for Baby program. Text for Baby, the country's first free health education program in the form of text messages, provides timely tips and expert advice sent directly to the cell phones of pregnant women and new moms. Pregnant women and new mothers who text BABY or BB for Spanish to 511 411 receive weekly text messages timed to their due date or their baby's birth date through the baby's first year. The messages, which have been developed by government and nonprofit health experts like the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention and the American Academy of Pediatrics, deal with nutrition, immunization, and birth defects prevention, among other topics. I'm Deanna O'Donnell. That's your news across Nevada.